NetDocuments is proud to introduce ND Office, a powerful and seamless way to integrate NetDocuments into your Office applications. The goal of ND Office is to complement the ND web service by streamlining the creation and editing of documents. To minimize training needs, ND Office replaces the standard open and save dialogues with a common design across multiple applications. In this tutorial, we will be demonstrating ND Office version 1.5.5, which was released in May of 2015. While we will use Word in this demonstration, the same functions are available for Excel and PowerPoint. We will also show you how to use ND Office in Outlook. Your administrator will likely install ND Office for you. To open an existing document, go to File Open. This will display the Open dialog. Here, you can find documents throughout the navigation pane. This shows all available locations in a simple hierarchy layout. Home will display all items that are pinned to your home page. Recent documents will show the most recent 40 documents. Recent locations displays the 10 most recent places you've saved or opened something. There are three ways to access a document's versions. You can right-click on the document and go to Versions to either quickly open a version or to access the entire version's dialog, including any compared attached documents. You can also click on the version number of a document to open the version's dialog, showing a list of that document's versions. You can also manage versions using the Versions menu at the top left. You can change the way items display in the right viewing pane by changing the size of the icons. You can also adjust the size of the left and right panes. In addition to the left navigation pane, you can find documents through a search. ND Office provides a simple search as well as an advanced search. The simple search allows you to search a particular field. You can choose from name, doc ID, modified by, created by, or everything, which includes all available fields. The advanced search displays the main search fields available. You can go to the web app for more searching options. You can also adjust the size of your search box. Selecting a document will open it in the app for editing. You will see a notification when a document is opened. Clicking Save or Control S will commit your changes back to NetDocuments in real time, even while the document remains checked out and open for editing. Once you are finished making your edits, go to Save As for more options. On the Save dialog, if you are editing an existing document, by default, you will be prompted to save the document as a new version. You could also save it as a separate new document by unchecking the New Version box. You can also rename the document or change the file type while you save it. As you may notice, you will only see documents that match the file type of that document that you are saving. Profiling is available depending on the filing location. To profile a document without selecting a location, you can select a cabinet as a filing location, then simply complete the document's profile. The next time you save a document, the cabinet will then default as the most recent location. To save it as a new version of another document, browse or search for the other document, highlight it, and check the box to save as a new version. To create and save a new document, just click Save and select a location, or just complete the profile for the document. Once your edits have been saved, you can simply close the document. The document will automatically be checked back into Net Documents in the background. A notification will appear on the bottom right, showing that your document has been checked in. To email a document link or a copy of the document, go to Outlook. ND Office in Outlook consists of two buttons, ND Attach and ND Save. ND Attach allows you to retrieve an existing document and attach it to an email. Similar to the Open dialog, you will be able to browse or search for the file to attach. You can choose to insert a copy of the document or a link to the document or both. ND Save allows you to save emails or attachments to net documents. Select a location. You can choose to save the entire MSG file or separate the body from the attachments. Settings are available from the icon in the system tray. ND Office has an echo folder that is separate from the regular echo folder. It can be found here. A subfolder called Backup will also be in the echo folder to serve as a recovery location. 
Automatic updates can be turned on or off. If set to prompt, you'll be prompted to install updates when they become available. ND Office can insert the NetDocuments doc ID into Word documents. This setting can be changed from the drop-down menu here. We hope you enjoy your experience in using ND Office. For support questions or further documentation, visit support.netdocuments.com.